But we begin in New Haven where the city is making another move to get guns off the street with a gun buyback program. The question is, will it really make a difference? News H Brian Spiros, live in New Haven newsroom this noon with the details on what's going on. Brian. Well, Keith, a great deal of gun violence has erupted in the city over the last few weeks. That has the city coming up with ways to hopefully put a stop to some of the problem. For many people who live in New Haven, they've taken notice of all the gun violence in recent weeks. You're worried. You're, you're really worried. You're worried about your children, their well-being. The shootings have led to people being badly injured or killed. City leaders are now looking for ways to curb this violence. One of the ideas is to have a gun buyback program. If the gun is available, it can be used. If it's not available, it can't be. That is why we do gun buybacks. Officer David Hartman says the buyback program is still in the planning stages. Here's how it works. People are able to turn in their guns, no questions asked. They're then given a gift card of some sort as an incentive. After being checked to see whether or not they were involved in a crime, the guns are then destroyed. That's a really good idea. If it works, hopefully maybe the crime rate will go down. Maybe, maybe not, but it's something to start with. In the past, the city has had several buyback programs, which in total have netted more than 240 guns. That's 242 completely operational, able to be used in the commission of a crime guns. If you do have a gun, get it off the streets. I mean, older people, younger people, there's a lot of kids taking each other's lives for no reason. Now, city officials say right now that gun buyback program is being planned for some time next month, and once they have the date, we'll certainly let you know. Live in the newsroom, Brian Spiros, News 8.